Imagine you've got some savings in the bank, or maybe you're investing in the stock market. One of the big questions you might be wondering is, how long will it take for my money to double? You might think it's complicated to figure out, but here's the secret. You don't need a fancy calculator or a finance degree to get the answer. Instead, all you need to know is the rule of 72. The rule of 72 is a quick, easy way to understand the power of compound interest and how long it'll take for your money to double. And today, I'm going to show you exactly how it works and why it's so powerful. What is the rule of 72? The rule of 72 is a super simple formula used by investors, financial planners, and anyone curious about money growth. Here's the basic idea. To find out how long it'll take for your money to double at a given interest rate, just take the number 72 and divide it by the interest rate. Result is the approximate number of years it'll take for your money to double. So if you're getting a 6% interest rate, divide 72 by 6, and that tells you it'll take about 12 years for your money to double. If you're getting 8% interest, divide 72 by 8, and your money will double in 9 years. It's that simple. The math behind it. Now, you might be wondering, why 72? Where does that number come from? The rule of 72 is based on a concept in mathematics called compound interest. This means your money grows not just on the original amount, but also on the interest that keeps adding up year after year. Think of it like a snowball. As it rolls, it gathers more snow and grows faster. 72 works because it's a close approximation of the formula for compound growth. It's especially accurate for interest rates between 2% and 12%, which covers most realistic returns you'd expect to see from banks or investments. What makes the rule of 72 so valuable is how simple and versatile it is. You don't need to dive into complex math or spend time punching numbers into a calculator. And it's great for real-life situations. Let's say you're at a party and someone asks, if I invest at 6%, how long will it take my money to double? You can answer in seconds. The rule of 72 also gives you a sense of control and foresight over your financial future. It allows you to make quick estimates and smarter decisions about where to invest your money. To make the rule of 72 even clearer, let's go through a few examples. Imagine you've got a certain amount of money you're investing, and let's calculate how long it'll take to double based on different interest rates. Example number one, savings account at 3% interest. Let's say you're putting your money in a savings account with a 3% interest rate. 72 divided by 3 is equal to 24. It will take roughly 24 years for your money to double. So, if you invest $1,000 today, you'd have about $2,000 in 24 years just by letting it sit and grow. Example number 2. Stock market average at 8% interest. Now, let's look at a typical long-term stock market investment which has historically averaged around 8% per year. 72 divided by 8 is equal to 9 at an 8% rate. Your money will double in about 9 years. So, if you invested that same $1,000, it would be worth $2,000 in just 9 years. The faster doubling time is why many people invest in the stock market. Another interesting way to use the rule of 72 is with inflation. Inflation is the rate at which prices for goods and services increase over time, effectively reducing your purchasing power. Let's say inflation is running at 3% per year. Using the rule of 72, 72 divided by 3 is equal to 24. This means it would take 24 years for prices to double or for the value of your money to be cut in half in terms of purchasing power. So the Rule of 72 can be a reminder of why it's so important to invest in ways that keep up with or outpace inflation. As useful as it is, the rule of 72 isn't perfect. It doesn't consider taxes, fees, or fluctuations in interest rates. It's just a guideline, an estimate to give you a quick answer without complex math. Also, the rule of 72 works best with consistent interest rates, which aren't always the case in real life. Interest rates in the stock market, for instance, can vary year to year. But if you're investing for the long term, the rule of 72 can still give you a good overall sense of how your money will grow. One of the best ways to use the rule of 72 is as a tool for financial goals. Let's say you have a goal to double your savings in the next 10 years. Using the rule of 72, you know you'll need an investment that returns about 7.2% annually. Now you can look for investment options that might get you close to that rate. 
Or, if you're thinking about starting an investment plan for retirement, you can reverse the rule of 72. If you want your money to double multiple times over a few decades, the rule of 72 can help you see how much you'll need to invest and what rates to look for. Final thoughts. The rule of 72 is more than just a number trick. It's a quick, reliable way to understand how long it'll take for your money to grow. With just a little bit of math, you can make smarter financial decisions, whether you're saving for a future purchase, investing in the stock market, or planning for retirement. Remember, the rule of 72 gives you a peek into the future of your money. By understanding how your money can grow, you gain control over your financial choices and the ability to make your money work for you.